Hey guys, it's Olivia and I'm back with another video. So I would say in the 90s and early 2000s, there was this thing called a do-rag and people used it as a fashion statement. You'd probably see a lot of rappers wearing it. It was just a part of your outfit. And yes, do-rags still exist and they might have existed before that, but it was within that time frame that it was a fashion statement. But what do-rags are actually for are to protect your do, as in your hair do. And that's what this video is going to be about. But before we get into this week's video, be sure to subscribe to my channel because I make new videos every Monday. I make anywhere from topic videos like this to how to make money online videos to pop socket videos. And with all that being said, let's get into this week's video. So as previously stated, the purpose of a do-rag is to protect your hairdo. But I know some people, mainly guys, who wear a do-rag 100% of the time. And I understand wearing a do-rag to sleep. I wear a do-rag to sleep to protect my hair. Like if I get my hair done, I put on a do-rag to make it get frizzy at a slower rate. Like wrapping your hair at night helps to protect your hair. I get that. Or if it were humid outside, so you put on a do-rag. Or if it's raining outside. Or if you're gonna wear a hat. I understand wearing a do-rag to protect your do. But you see, the thing is, if you wear a do-rag at times other than when you're asleep or the weather is bad or you're wearing a hat, then there's no point. The point of a do-rag is to protect your hairdo. But if you're wearing a do-rag all the time, then no one's ever going to see your hair. So what's the point of going through all this effort to protect your hair if no one's ever going to see it? So that's pretty much it. That's pretty much my only point. That's pretty much all I have to say. Why are you keeping your hair do intact if no one's going to see it? Why did you go and get your hair done? Maybe you got your hair cut or maybe you have long hair and you went and got it braided. You have some cornrows. You went out, paid somebody to do your hair just so that no one would ever see it. And yes, I understand, maybe you don't do your hair for other people, you don't do your hair so that other people can be like, hey, did you get a haircut? Or did you do something different with your hair? Maybe you just do your hair for you, and that's wonderful. But, like, once again, it's covered all the time. So, if you're wearing a do-rag and you walk past a mirror, you still can't see your own hair. So, you're not doing your hair for other people, and you're not doing your hair for yourself. So who are you doing it for? <laughs> like, why did you get your hair done if you were just gonna cover it 100% of the time? No one else is ever gonna get to see it. You're never gonna get to see it. What was the point? I don't understand. You wanna know what I think you should do? I think you should not get your hair done, but then put on a do-rag so that people think you got your hair done and you're trying to protect a new do. So that saves you money and it makes people think that you have good hair. Or maybe that's what you're already doing and you all have me fooled. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I more or less just have a question. Why did you get your hair done and then go through all the effort of protecting your hairstyle just to keep protecting it forever and then no one will ever see it. But anyways, that's all for this week's video. I just have that question. If you are someone who wears a do-rag all the time or if you know someone who does and they can answer this question for me, that would be great if you could do so in the comments down below. <laughs> but with all that being said, that's all for this week's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you think your friends will enjoy it, be sure to share it with them. All my social media links will be down below in case you want to follow me on there. Be sure to subscribe to my channel because I make new videos every Monday and I'll see you next Monday with a new video. Be sure to sub... You want to know what I think you should do? I think you should not get your hair done. Oh, it's not recording, is it? Of course.
course it's not. 